Hello? Hello? Everybody. And also BB, apparently. Welcome to Minecraft. Hello. Got a good amount of stuff today. First, you're probably going to notice this pretty quickly. So I'm just going to point it out now. I whipped up a new skin. It is not incredible. It is not something an artist was commissioned for. It is not something that is going to blow your minds. But I took the skin that I had before, that I had made in high school, and I turned it into ba -ba -ba -ba, a skin. Uh, a uh, my like my oh boy that does not look great on the sides does it my boy needs a new haircut maybe I should commission an artist but I turned it into my boy my lad my my avatar okay okay that's that's not a good haircut that's that's an asymmetrical ass haircut isn't it yep no that looks a lot better that looks that looks good so in case you're wondering first of all there were two things I, I tried to do with the skin that didn't work out right. One was it's supposed to be symmetrical and not just one-sided. And the other was it wasn't supposed to look like crap. Uh, those are the two parts that I failed at. <laughs> but instead of looking like high school me, it looks like my, my fiery lad. So that's, so that's good. Also, a, a very handy thing you can do with this skin. First of all, I, I guess I should show it for a few seconds. But yeah, I, I like it. I might might need to cover that bit of blue with purple. It's not great, but we're working on it. We're working on it. But one cool thing you can do with the skin is you can just never look at it ever. So that works. Also, hello, zombie. Ooh, it is also quite hot today, so you may frequently see me like reach over to my air conditioner to have my to, like cool my hands down and such. I'm hoping that it cools down a little bit. It's good, thank you. So, let's see. Let's see, let's see. Wow, it is. It is actually getting so hot. It's actually super not great. I don't know why the music stopped. Okay. Still trying to get it to work. Is there something we can help you with? What's going on with it? We go and see. Are we gonna see? You heard her. So we are going to be get. I am going to be doing some dangerous stuff today. So we're going to get, be getting some iron tools, and um, I want to get the mending enchantment put on a book, because then that will allow me to put it onto my super. That'll allow me to put the mending onto my super good pickaxe so that I can use it infinitely. Uh, if if it doesn't offer mending for a book, then I can just put an enchantment on an iron tool instead, and that will refresh it, and so we can keep going until we get mending. And that will give me a load of iron tools that are enchanted, which is very good if you plan to maybe die and you don't want to use expensive tools. <laughs> Okay, that's a, that's that's a that's a good start to the stream. And now we can hear chewing. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> okay, so so we're gonna start out with a bit of enchanting. Uh, what I'm planning to do 
is um I need to turn down the music a little bit more because it's doing that thing where it just raises in volume a lot. Um What was I saying? We we are going to make a tunnel to the There he go. So, I plan to make a, um, I, I think I want to start a mine in the nether so we can get netherite, but then I also want to, um, so there's a trick you can use where every time you move one block in a direction in the nether, that's eight blocks in the overworld. So if we make a tunnel in the nether, like if we make a portal in the mansion and a portal in the village that go to the nether and then make a tunnel that connects the nether portals, it can be a much, much shorter uh, tunnel than in the overworld. So we are going to be making a tunnel like that and then also maybe making another farm for, or another mine for uh, another right. Uh, and for that, we want iron tools that are enchanted and iron armor because that way if we die, we just lose some iron stuff. It's not a big deal. I'm sure it is quite amazing. Uh, I'm all right for now. Thank you, though. Why do I? Oh, right. I have those books for enchanting table. Whatever. I can. I can spend them. I am the owner of those items, and therefore I've decided that they can be spent. Apologies, but I, I've been on the internet long enough that I have enough paranoia about that sort of thing that that's just immediately setting off a good number of alarm bells. But I, I, I hope you have fun with it. <laughs> so, so I need to enchant, uh, I need to enchant, um, mending on a book. I need to enchant these tools. Where's my iron armor? There's my iron armor. I'm going to want to enchant that as well. And I am going to want to take all of the really good stuff and just put that the hell away. I hopefully won't die because I don't want to lose my levels, but it wouldn't be as big of a deal as dying with a bunch of irons or diamond stuff. It is sleep time, however. walk away from me in my asymmetrical haircut um let's see book piercing unbreaking protection that is nothing that we need and therefore we will instead enchant a pickaxe with that so now book smite or sharpness or efficiency that's nothing that we need so we enchant a pickaxe with that how about a book nope pickaxe How about a book? Nope. <laughs> How about a pickaxe? How about a book? Fuck that. Okay, actually, feather falling. That's pretty neato. I like that. Okay, how about a book? Again. No. How about fucking, I don't know, a damaged pickaxe? Because I don't, I don't care at this point. 
No, that's that's kind of crappy. How about a shovel? Sure, we'll we'll give it unbreak. How about a book? Didn't get the best rolls. How about a book? Okay, I can enchant the sword, and after that, I can't enchant anymore. I don't even want any of these things that you give to me. Okay, so, not great. What was BB saying? Wait, come see. Wait, come see where. Oh, okay. Oh! Oh! What a swank! What a swank! What a swank! Is this a place that I can... Is this for Ferris's? Threatening BB. We're out. We're going. We're off, lads. We're off, lads, before it's off with our head, lads. I'm gonna go get some more pickaxes. <laughs> My plan sleeping foiled. I'm gonna go get some more pickaxes and I'm gonna keep enchanting until I die. Because that, that happens. If you enchant ten times in a row, you explode. Some of you haven't played Minecraft yet, and maybe I shouldn't tell random lies in case it actually confuses you. It... Did... Did... Did you... Rip parts of your wall out... For that? That's a big capital XD from me. Your floor is striped logs. Stripped, stripped logs. Yeah, this was their house and they decided to cannibalize the wall. <laughs> Actually, that hurts me. Oh, why would you do this? Uh, yeah, yeah, like, it occurred to me that you were watching, and I was like, oh, wait, wait, hey, no, hang on, we should teach zombie how to play, not teach zombie a bunch of random lies. That probably is suboptimal to teach zombie random lies for no reason. So let's go ahead and just, just clarify that I'm full of shit. Love the screen shake. Love the screen shake. And that's how you farm. You got it downloaded. Nice. I gotta be honest, the reason I'm currently tending the farm is I realized I'm getting low on steak. And I kind of feel bad for saying that. You breed cows with wheat and then you uh, turn them into other items like steak and leather. I'm also collecting all the backup seeds, which is going to be really nice if we ever decide to get chickens. Say, 
you just feed the cows wheat and they go into love mode, which is what it is called, I'm not shitting you. And they do a breed and they make a baby and you get some experience for the process of doing this. And then when there's enough cows, you decide that you want some less cows and... Okay, uh, let me pause for just a second so I can go to the site that I was using for the skin. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Ba -ba 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 -ba. There you are. So, uh, if you go to that website, Normally making a skin is this bizarre process where you have this weird flat PNG that you have to change the colors on and it's really unintuitive to figure out what's what. But then if you use a tool like that, it just gives you a 3D model of the skin and you paint on it and then it just prints you out the PNG you need. So that is much less of a pain in the ass than the default way. And you're welcome. I, I was using it before stream, so I had it on hand. Uh, what was I doing? I wasn't doing anything. I'm just going to store the wheat here. The wheat does not go here. But I'm storing it there, because I am truly a villain. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and borrow their crafting bench, because I'm tru truly a villain. Bop. Okay, look at that. I suddenly have a lot of pickaxes. Isn't that nuts? Anything? Wait, no, that's not what I'm trying to do. Book. Mending? No. Fortune is good. So to clarify what I'm doing... Um, you can put various enchantments onto an item, but if the item is already enchanted and you want to do an, another enchantment, you've got to put the enchantment on a book, and then you put the things together. So because I have a really amazing pickaxe, I am trying to get the mending en enchantment, which means that it will repair itself so I can use it forever. Um, if it doesn't allow me to get mending, because it selects enchantments randomly, so if it doesn't give me the enchantment I want, then I just enchant some random pickaxe with whatever the heck they'll allow me to put on it. And then now it'll give me new selections. And I'm going to keep doing this until it gives me what I want. Feather falling is actually not bad. I guess I'm going to get two feather fallings. And then I'm hoping eventually I can get mending, but who knows? I am spending levels every time I do this, so it's not the best. Uh, any more pickaxes? I can hear BB chewing. I guess I will go get more pickaxes. This is... maybe not. I only borrowed their crafting bench, which is, like, it, it actually is fine. It actually just like I like I'm just using it. It doesn't it doesn't it doesn't spend it. All right, for now I have a lot of uh, enchanted pickaxes, so I'm gonna go put these to some use before we continue to make things. Um, before we continue to enchant things, rather. Ba, 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 ba. Da, 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 da. You cannot use water in the Nether. You can use a shield. Ba, ba, ba. And by the way, if the stuff I'm if stuff I'm saying quickly starts to seem like too much information, don't worry. There's a lot of random bullshit to learn, but it's 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 I guess I guess you could compare it to D and D in the sense of like there's a lot of stuff to learn, but you don't really need to know all of it right out of the gate, and it all quickly starts feeling easy to figure out like like faster than you would expect. Yeah. That is the other thing. If you just hear me rambling about you can do this and this and this and this and this and this and this, it's going to sound a lot worse than it actually is. Yeah. Why? 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 Oh, hello? I don't understand the reason for a wool. I didn't enchant my armor, did I? Where did I put my armor and why did I put my armor where I put it? Let me get my books back because I have to enchant that stuff. So I might as well try for some more. Oh, they, they meant sleep time. 
I should have known. What else could a woe possibly mean? I don't have my freaking lapis. I don't have my lapis on me. God dang it. Uh, lapis. Lapis, 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 lapis. I suppose it's also good that I'm wasting all my levels, because then if I die in the nether, I don't lose all my levels. So that's fine. Okay, so I don't have any levels at all left, I guess. Level requirement's nine. I didn't realize that. Um, I guess we're just gonna go as is then. Okay, so I got my stuff. Oh, ooh, that's not what I meant to do. Let's see, that is negative four. Let's just say negative 400, negative 400. Let me write that down on my note. So we need to go. We need to go uh, negative 600 blocks X and negative 5,600 blocks Z. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh, nice. So. Yep. So, 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 so. One block in the nether is eight blocks in the overworld, so we just, so I need to go, what was it, negative 600 blocks. I'm just gonna be real goddamn lazy. And just use a calculator. Okay, so X negative 75 Z negative 700. That is the direction, that is, those are things. Of the things that I need to do, those are on the list. Okay, so now we pull up video game. We pull up video game. How do we pull up video game? Is that a thing that I can... Is that a thing I could potentially muster? Has BP requested anything while it's dead? No. Okay. Okay. Oh, I do need frickin' obsidian, don't I? Hmm, I need obsidian and a point and steel. Do I have these things? I'm sure I have a flint and steel somewhere. I don't know if I have obsidian. Flint and steel. I have one block of obsidian, but I need like eight. So I'm going to use my pick. 
and I'm going to go get obsidian, and then we are going to go into the nether, and we're going to do some good stuff. Yes. That is, that is BB's cat Yumi. Oh. I see. BB is not the type to fill in the potholes that they make when they have creepers explode on them. Okay, I guess I guess I'm gonna go get some dirt out of the chest. Maybe if, maybe if I call it loudly enough, BB will hear my passive aggressive tone. I guess I'm gonna go fix BB's mess. Yeah, if you have uh, dirt next to grass, the grass will eventually just grow over it naturally. So right now, this all probably looks like crap. Uh, but it will look good eventually. Oh, hey, look. BB's Creeper Graveyard, I guess. I'm choosing to just assume that they are all his fault. And that's probably not fair. And I'm not very concerned. <laughs> I'm not very concerned with whether that's fair or not. Ooh. Okay, we should have some lava right, or some obsidian right here. We do. Be very careful when mining obsidian. It might have lava on the other side. Like that. Like that lava there. So I already have one. I think you'll need eight. You need ten. So I just need to get to nine obsidian and we'll be good. Good, that was that was what I wanted out of that block. Why is it so dark? My god. I'd I'd appreciate if that would stop happening. Just just gonna put that out there. Oh that was poorly thought out by me. But it's not an issue, so By the way, the tactic I'm using here is actually a tactic that I've never used before. I've heard about it, but I have never actually employed doing a nether portal. So this is going to be interesting. Uh, and I don't know if you saw it, if you saw it, if you've seen it before, zombie. But we got a, uh, I got an elevator set up, and that is this here. So I had to dig out this whole thing and light it all up. But then if I stand here and push the button. And it's free. It does take a bit, but it is not as slow as using the ladder. And it's also, like, because you don't have to do anything, you can, like, sort out your inventory while you're at it. And then when you get to the top, it will automatically, after a few seconds, back down. But then I have a one-way door here. That way you can get out, but people can't get in and then fall down the elevator shaft. So it's all very safe. Okay, I'm gonna go store the diamond pick so that it does not become rip. And then I believe we will be set up to start our journey into the nether.
Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I mined nine obsidian because there was one in the chest I could take. It would have been pretty dumb to not go ahead and take it out of the chest. Also, let's sleep first. Ready to slip? They keep, they keep giving, they keep giving me the oh, oh Also, I should bring cobblestone. I should bring things that I have decided that I need, instead of just not doing that at all. That probably would be a better alternative. Okay. 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 So I'm going to go into the nether, I'm going to write down the coordinates, and then I'm going to do my best to figure out the direction that I need to go to get to the place that I want to go in the nether. Hello, Ashton. Welcome to stream. Why? What the fuck? Hello? Hello, dead man. And I don't say that just because you're a skeleton. The fuck was all of that? Also, they added blue fire to Minecraft, so I'm officially canon, so I appreciate that. Okay, what are these coordinates? Negative 44, negative, let's just call it negative 40, negative 40 for the sake of simplicity. Ninja, hello. I'm doing all right, how are you, man? X, negative 40, Z, negative 40. Okay, so I need to go, what was it? I need to go negative 75 for X and negative 700 for Z. So if I keep my note up, that means negative 115 and negative, wait, yes. And then negative 740. So if I get to negative 115, negative 740-ish, uh, then that should be good, I guess. Okay, so I need to go this way. I'll go this way until we hit negative 115 on the X scale. So, Ninja, what we are doing is I am going to use nether portals to make a bridge between um, the mansion and our village. And so I'm going to make a tunnel that goes from the first portal to the second portal. Uh, if you're not familiar with the tactic, it's because every block in the nether is equivalent to eight blocks of travel in the overworld. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy, you want to just get this over with real quick? Yeah? yeah? Is that right? Thank you. Okay, negative. Ba, 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 ba. One fifteen, so it's roughly bop. And so then we just go that way. Just a lot. Undead discrimination. Uh, I, I discriminate undead creatures who choose to fire arrows at me for no reason. I do I do not discriminate undead creatures other than that. Oh, this is going to be fun to build. Oh, this is going to be a blast. We're all going to love every second of this. 
Once we hit a wall, I can just dig through the wall. I hope I don't get blown up, by the way. On the list of all things that I would consider ideal, that's not on the list. I hear some unsettling noises. I don't know about y'all. I hear some noises that just don't make me super happy. That's, so for anyone that might be wondering what all of that is, yeah, that's lava. Yeah, that's straight up lava. Um, so that's not the best. Also, I'm not wearing gold armor, so piglins will be furious with me for daring to not wear the latest fashion trends. So we're going to go ahead and try to not engage with them. Just waiting for a gas noise, yeah. Cobblestone cannot be destroyed by a gas, so this bridge will survive. However, I could knock I could be knocked off of the cobblestone. Uh and that would suck. I'm hearing interesting but dis but unsettling noises. Oh my god, it stopped placing cobblestone for a little while, and boy was I not happy about that. I don't wanna I don't wanna I don't Oh god, those are picklins with crossbows. We're out. We're out. We're out. We're out. I gotta I gotta go get I gotta go get my, my bling so that the piglins don't get angry with me. Because one arrow is all it'll take. Are, are you for real, sir? Are you for real? Literally coming back from the undeath. What, you want some? You want some? Huh? Okay, I missed. You want some? Okay, I missed. <laughs> okay, they left, so that means I win. I don't like um, I don't like spending gold on armor because I like using gold for rails, but this is probably a worthy cause. By the way, the reason I have those blue torches or lanterns near the portal is because apparently piglins do not like the blue fire, and so if you make blue fire lanterns and put it around the portal they won't be near the portal when you spawn. Doesn't work on skeletons, as we've seen, so that's great, but, uh, but it's something, I guess. Might need some more call. Okay, do I have any gold armor already in existence? Other than for horses? Curse of Binding. <laughs> No thanks. No thanks. For those of you who don't know, Curse of Binding means if you put this shit on, you're not taking this shit off until you die. And I'm not a fan of that, so... <laughs> Proper communication. More can be said with the eyes than the words ever could.
It is pretty good, yeah. Excuse me, sir. Have you seen my control over my life? Excuse me. It is apparently their pony. <laughs> Tea bagged my way into the nether. As you do. I'm going to want to make a bridge that isn't soul sand so you can move quickly here. Yeah? Yeah, is that right? Yeah? Yeah, huh, punk? Yeah? Oh. Okay, I, I'll get it eventually. Yeah? Yeah, huh, punk? Yeah? Huh, bush? I'll get it eventually. I, I, I will get it eventually as long as they don't fly away into the sunset or I die. Those two things would cause me to not get it eventually. I hope they didn't take it away from the game. I wish I could stop burning. Oh boy, do I wish I could stop burning. Yeah, hip yeah, huh, punk? Okay, they flew away. Okay, that means that means I got the moral victory again, I guess. And yeah, for anyone thinking, well, I have a bucket of water, why don't I use that to douse myself? Water doesn't work in the nether. If you put it down, it just, pssst, just evaporates. No. It's a really good strategy to just say no, but then continue to run over the lava and why does the sky turn red? So piglins, as long as I don't mess with them, should no longer mess with me on the grounds that I'm wearing gold. Because for some reason they get angry at you if you're not wearing gold. Hello? I don't even see you this time. Oh, whatever. What? Eh? Oh, oh, there you are. Yeah, see, you can knock it back at him. You want to try it again, punk, huh? 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 A punk? Huh? That's what I thought. I will eventually want to mine these areas because this stuff is pretty cool. But for now, I want to be at least somewhat focused. Classes, yes. They really like gold, but in this weird way of like, if you mine gold in the nether, this will anger them because you are stealing their gold. But then when it comes to you wearing gold, they You're want fantastic. you to wear gold. And they'll be mad at you if you don't. A thing that also makes them mad is the fact that I haven't lowered the volume of my alerts and so it gives me frequent heart attacks. Ashton, thank you for the follow. Thank you very much. gonna pretend this isn't a... oh, we're just gonna pretend this doesn't exist do I have an axe on me no I would have what why would I have that on me apparently these are nether wart trees I guess and we're just gonna we're just gonna go right on through these are mushroom lamps, I believe. Shroom light. Very neat. Oh, another little another little tidbit. Um, monsters spawn in dark areas, but that is not the case in the nether. In the nether, they don't give a shit about light. So, And also, generally, things are lighter than in the overworld. Like, if there's no light source, you'll still be able to see anyway. So you're not going to see me bother with torches very often in the nether specifically. And the reason I'm just, like, being very stubborn about this tunnel is I want to make it a railway. 
And so I think in the long run, it's probably going to be less of a pain in the ass if I'm just very stubborn and I say, no, this is where my tunnel is. Fuck anything in the way. And eventually I will make it so it is covered so that you will not be shot at while you are riding it. But for now, we're just... For now, we're getting there. Later on, we can do the rest. I don't think those guys are particularly nice, but they also cannot fly. So I'm just going to ignore them as I'm ignoring most of the things here. And I'm pretending that we're just in the overworld in a nice, bright, red place. Okay, wonderful. Oh my god. Never mind what I said about not bothering with torches. I can't see a thing. See, now we're cooking. Because now I'm no longer building over lava and I'm just using enchanted pickaxes. Okay, I need to get to negative 740. We are at... So, um, uh... <laughs> We've got about 130 blocks in the wrong direction. So that's, that's nice. <laughs> that's, that's really nice. That's, that's, yep. 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 We're just gonna, we're just, yep. Yep. <laughs> yep. Okay. We have to do the same thing though on this side. Oh my god. Oh, hi, Ghast. I'm glad that I'm gonna have you for this journey. You wanna, you wanna, you wanna fire a ball, my guy? Hello? Oh, they're waiting until it's going to be peak danger for me. Okay. So I'm pretty sure I'm going the right way now, right? Yes, we are making it more negative as we go. I wanted to, like, basically, we are at, like, negative 40. I needed to be at negative 700. So my brain was like, okay, that is a bigger number. Go the way where the number gets bigger. And so instead of going in the negatives, I went in the positives. Oh, my God, it is... I don't know how long I can do this without something going wrong, realistically. Oh boy. Oh boy, it's just a whole lot of stuff I don't want to deal with.
I am also running out of cobble because, you know, my cobble just sort of disappeared for no reason. I'm out of cobble. And I don't want to build the bridge out of netherrack because that can be easily destroyed. So we're going back and we're getting some more stone. I probably have more in the mine. And then we're coming back again. Probably go ahead and make a uh, a nether rack bridge so that we don't have to go on the the uh, nether wart. Just make it slightly faster. I do have a shovel, don't I? Okay. So we're just going to get a bit of stone, and I'll be right back. Is that... See, this is why you keep your cobblestone. It may seem like garbage at the time, but boy does it come in handy to just have loads of it on hand. That was not meant to be a pun. a little bit there, but that's fine. Okay, so this time, I'm pretty certain that this tunnel will be what we need. Why? Why always this one skeleton in this one spot? That is what I think of you. Okay, so. I need to go to negative 115, and that is this. And I need to go to negative 740, and that is this direction. So we should be good if I just literally go this way for a while. And then I'll probably build the first portal a little ways off. That way the portal doesn't end up like appearing in the mansion then I'll build a manual portal in the mansion and then connect them walking without being able to see where you're going in the nether is just such a great feeling into the fire room. That's where I wanted to go.
Okay. Okay, if I were to dig- that's gold, so if I were to dig that, it would anger the piglins. So I might do that later. Oh, wonderful. Oh great, that's a good noise. Still, ooh, we're still a ways off, but we're making good progress. It's going to be dramatically faster than it was yesterday, because we know exactly where we're going, and it will be an eighth of the distance. A bit more dangerous in places, but still an eighth of the distance. Which is nuts, by the way. Literally eight. Like, it is eight times faster than using the overworld. Once this is done, once this is done, this is going to save so much time. That's the thing about automation. In the short term, it seems like it's a waste of time. In the long term, it is such a good time. It's such a good time saver. Oh, is that right? Is that right, you punk? Don't even need my shit. Don't even need it. You're not going to want the path to be made of soul sand because you move slower on soul sand. And then just to make sure monsters can't get in, this area is going to be sealed off. Oop. Eventually, I'll probably make the whole thing sealed up, but for now, this just makes it so it's not going to get filled with monsters, at least. That's why you pay attention to things and stuff. That's why you look where you're going when you are in a hellscape that you don't want to fall into. We got very lucky here that there wasn't any bad stuff to fall into. In my defense, it's a lot of red. It's kind of hard to tell which is the red that you can walk on and which is the red that's a few feet down. But I am definitely a little more alert and cautious as of now. We're just going to pretend that the nether rack never even ended.
gotta relax and remind myself I don't have anything that I can't rebuild. It is all fine if I die in this particular situation. Another Sherlock's reminding me that it's a bad spooky place. making the tunnel really unnecessarily tall here, aren't I? No, 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 because I'm doing this. And so it's not tall. Okay. It is the exact height it was meant to be. This is going to take so much cobblestone. Jesus Christ. So for most of the tunnel, I haven't even been building the walls, and yet I'm still spending so much cobblestone. I was just thinking, like, this is going real smooth. They're making a lot of progress. Alright, only 330 more blocks. So we ended up starting, like, I ended up going to, like, a positive 140. So we've gone over a, a good bit more than what what is still left. So we have gone over more than half. Sort of. Very careful here, very carefully just giving ourselves a privacy screen from this ghast. A privacy screen from this ghast, I said. I'm gonna jump off the other side, so I'm just gonna give us a, a safety rail.
Alright. Back to the wall, nice and safe. Oh, for God's sakes, what now? Yeah, I'm thinking about how much cobble I need now. I guess the path is like 600 blocks. But then if you have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So that's what, 4,800 blocks? So that's a lot of blocks. These skeletons, my guy. They don't bother me, I won't bother them. They're bothering me. I guess this actually I can just fill in with netherrack really, as long as it's not soul sand and there's no like death pit below it. Doesn't need to be made of cobble. Eventually, I will make a tunnel, but for now, just a pathway is fine. I really got to start paying attention just a little bit. Just a little bit. I got to start paying attention just a little bit when you're digging in literal hell. Can I can I not be on fire for a little bit? Thank you. Jeez, that fire is persistent. All right, am I am I good otherwise? Can I just go on otherwise? Plenty of pickaxes, my guy. So we're at, at about negative. We're, we're at about 560. So we need to hunt another 180 blocks. As long as the the netherrack continues. That should be fine. Don't worry, piglins. I'm not mining your gold. I know there would be hell to pay. That's not... Wasn't meant to be a pun. Wasn't meant to be a pun. I keep making puns, and I'm not meaning to. Oh, are you for real?
I, I guess I guess the piglins can just fuck themselves because I have to mine this. Yeah, that's what I thought too. It's all his fault. Definitely not mine. Yeah, you 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 stop that. You stop that. Just gonna put a plug right there. Okay. So I think I'm now the enemy of the piglins, but fuck it. That noise you hear is them. Oh god, are they going to come? Yes. Think. They might just die bomb me at any point. And I'm not looking forward to that jump scare. because it didn't occur to me that I would need to chop wood in hell. Still have a good bit of cobble. We're not a ton, but we're not about to run out. I wonder what BB needed those two obsidian blocks for. I also wonder why he couldn't have just fucking gone and got some. <laughs> From the fucking mine that I set up. I wonder all of these things. That message server saved the game. I thought for a second that was BB some, like just returning to say, hey, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> Okay, negative 604. We're, we're getting there, lads. It's a long journey, but we're getting there. I think for here, I'm just going to make this bridge. Like, like I said, I can make the tunnel later. Let's just get there for now. It'll feel like less of a slog if we can just get there quickly and then work on, like, making a tunnel and making a railway and all that after we get there. It's all about changing the order to make things feel less Don't know what the word for it is. But just changing the order so that it just doesn't feel like it's going as slow as it might otherwise feel. Hello? Getting, I think, pretty close. Less than a hundred blocks. That's something. I 
I'm also not 100% certain if the piglins hate me or not. Because I'm not sure. Like, maybe they don't know that I took the gold because I was in a tunnel at the time. So they might be chill with me. Or they might hate me. It, it really could be either one. And I don't know. And that is the real terror. The ambiguity. Not knowing if they would rip my head off or offer me a trade. some bread when we get back home. I don't like these noises regardless of whether they indicate anger or not. Negative 700. Okay, I guess we might find out if they're angry or not. They sound like kinda angry noises. I guess I could make the sides netherrack. I don't know. Piku, hello! We were just talking about how I can't stop making puns, and it's definitely all your fault. So thank you. goes the crafting. We are uh, tunneling, actually. So I don't know how much, I don't know how much I've remembered to say in the chat or how much you've seen, but um, we found a woodland mansion. We cleared it out and I decided that it is going to be like a group place, like we're all going to own it together as a guild hall. And so I want to make a path there. Problem is, Holy crap, it is so far away. So we are making a nether tunnel to allow us to go there in a way that does not take literal years. Yeah. Should be a pretty enjoyable time. I'm not really sure what we're going to put in a guild hall, but I figure we might like each have our own room. But then I'm not sure what you would have in your room in a guild hall. So I don't know, this might end up being a kind of boring idea, but like, I, I feel like the idea of like a far away place that you can get to very quickly and easily through the nether, where we all like have our own setups and stuff. I feel like that's a pretty fun idea, but we will see if it ends up being fun or not. We're pretty close. Uh, do, 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 do. I, how far away do I want to be? I would think maybe 40 blocks so when we're at like 735-ish. Just going straight through this tree. God, the noises are not pleasant.
Okay, monsters could potentially get you here, so this isn't great. Whoa. Lads, this is it. Negative 741. Okay. So, we are going to be a little removed because I don't want the portal to just pop up in the mansion itself. So, I'm going to build it, let's say, here. Okay. Eventually you'll have a little more freedom with this portal, but for now it's just going to be meant to be secure. So no bad guys in here. Eventually, it'll be a proper fort. So this should be, like I said, not at the place, but like close-ish. And then we'll build a proper nether portal in the base. And then wherever that pops out, we'll connect it. Immediately, gravel falls down in my face as the portal opens. So that's just a real indication of some fun stuff. Okay, I remember the gravel area. I think that was the beach that we landed on. Oh, dang. Uh, so is it like the, the screen totally pauses here and there? lowered my settings in game a bit maybe that'll fix it let me know if it keeps keeps on doing it thank you for telling me and then I believe yes yes so I didn't bring the materials for another another portal because I'm good at planning but um, I'm gonna head back we're gonna get some more obsidian and we're gonna do this Yeah, I believe that means we're dropping frames. And if it, like, actually totally freezes up for a few seconds, then that's a significant amount. Um, hopefully, lowering my in-game frames should fix that. But we will see. Are you for real? Are you for real? <laughs> well, I'm gonna equip my shield as we go back into the nether now. Did did y'all did y'all happen to see what I just did with that lad? <laughs> Cause it wasn't pleasant. All right. Nope. Oh. Well, let's let's go say hi to our new friend, oh buddy pal. It's fine. It only destroyed the portal in the area around it. That's no big deal at all. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, let's see. Does it go to the same place that it used to? Because it's possible that it won't. Nope, it goes to the same place. Okay. Hoping that there's no more creepers. Okay. Okay, okay, we now have a way there. I now need to make it so the way there is safe and get more obsidian so that I can build a portal directly in the mansion. But that is a huge milestone and what will eventually be some good stuff. I guess realistically the path doesn't have to be made of, obs of cobblestone so long as the path is totally solid because uh, guest, guests can destroy the stuff I'm building it out of right now. But if the guest can't see you, it won't try to destroy it. So it doesn't really matter as long as it completely blocks the guest's vision. And then if I can build netherrack, I have plenty of that. And yeah, crisis averted. No big deal. That's why you carry a shield with you, lads. Apparently shields are actually pretty overpowered when it comes to diffusing a creeper. It just sort of does the job for you. Then it doesn't even need to be lit, but I just like the idea that we can easily see. But if I miss some spots here and there, it's not going to cause any monsters to spawn or anything like that. Still lag spikes? I wish Streamlabs was a bit better about telling me. They're supposed to tell you when that sort of thing happens, but it doesn't work right. Um, I think I have had this issue before, so it's it's likely not your end. Uh, let's see. What could I do? I think I'm just going to have to restart the stream at a lower frame rate. I think that's going to be the best option. Uh, so don't go anywhere, y'all. I will be right back, but I'm going to close the stream, lower my settings, and turn it back on. So be right back. Hello, hello, everybody. Alright, so it should now be showing in 30 FPS instead of 60, which hopefully should make it so that everything runs smoothly. Uh, do please let me know if that doesn't end up being the truth, and thank you for letting me know so far. Probably should stream that sometime, but I, I very, very much miss the bandwagon. Not that I usually am on the bandwagon, given that I'm currently streaming fucking Minecraft, but, but you know what I mean.
Nice. Uh, and yeah, can you uh, can you confirm for me in the settings? Does it? Um, it should show 1080p, but it it would either say 30 FPS or it would just say 1080p on its own. It, is it saying that, or is it saying lower than 1080p, or is it still saying 60? Because I'm hoping for same picture quality, lower frame rate, because lower frame rate is better than inconsistent frame rate. Ten eighty P. Okay. And then yeah, I think if it shows in thirty FPS, it just won't mention what the frames per second is. But if it's in sixty, it'll say sixty. So if it doesn't say anything, then that is what we are shooting for. Okay, it's starting to shape up. It's starting to shape up into a very clean passage. Oh boy, it is going to be a little bit, I guess. But it's getting there. For now, let's just carve out the path so it's a little more, a little easier to figure out what I was trying to do. I guess, I guess not. Yeah, yeah, they, they do not get better with age. Yeah, when the Enderman is just like in your walls like a rat and you just hear the, A the Enderman ASMR of them just gurgling as you do your business. It's a fun time. <laughs> Neighbor wanted to hang out after all, I see. You fucking punk ass. Alright, alright. You started it. You started it. No, you started it. No, no, no. No, no, no. You started this shit. You started this shit, dumbass. Anyway. What was I saying? just accidentally put a lot of gunpowder on his invitation. This is a thing I did, correct.
It was self-defense. I did not hurt him until he hurt me. Because, in fact, the, the, the only thing that I did that killed him was I knocked his projectile back at him. So if the thing that he sent at me wasn't lethal, it wouldn't have killed him. It only killed him because he was trying to kill me. I never actually struck him with the sword. I only knocked his his thingamajig back. There's just going to be a random little patch of wood. And that's fine. There's also going to be a random little... No. We're not using gravel. That's where I draw the line. Okay, something tells me we don't have enough blocks. But I'll do what I can. I'm sure I have more blocks in the overworld. Yeah, not enough blocks. Okay, so now I'm just going to go back and get more obsidian for the next portal. And then just get a, a bunch of blocks. Just a bunch of blocks. I guess we got eight more there, but whatever. Still got some sketchy areas. But we'll fix it eventually. My god, I'm gonna need so many rails. I'm gonna need so many rails. I hope it doesn't anger the piglins, but I'm going to get rid of this. It is in my way. That was not a fun noise. It sounded like a pig gurgling. Yeah, that would probably be the zombie pigment then. I heard a guest, and I don't appreciate that. So the, the bit of cobblestone with fire behind it indicates that you're supposed to turn. I did not mean to pour water. Okay, so for the moment, that makes it clear of, like, go that way. Which is supposed to not be a path of soul sand. You really gonna do this, pal? It's always this one respawning skeleton. Every time. Nobody else bothers me. Yeah. It's pretty neat. So that was 15 blocks. Let me just get 15 of this. Perfect. Shovel broke right as I got the last block. I did not need as much as I thought, though. What? You're a son of a bitch. Oh, you know what?
Yeah, it's right, you better run. Oh, back for seconds, huh? Okay, despawned. Or something. Something just occurred to me that the block I got to is, in fact, the block that it's telling me to turn. I don't know why I assumed that it was a right turn, though. It was not a right turn, was it? It was a left turn. It should be this way. Maybe not. Where is my home? Wait. Look, if it's a friendly game of neighborhood baseball, then why am I not supposed to hit the baseball with my baseball bat here? It's why I brought it. It's so that we could play the game. What's wrong with that? Is he not supposed to catch it and try to get me out? Is that not how video game? How non-video game? I don't even know how to refer to games when they aren't video. That's a problem. All right. What is this? Who would make such a terribly unsafe staircase? Couldn't possibly be twitch.tv slash basically VB. Could it? Where do I even think I'm going? Let them have their secrets. Anyway, back to the home. I need ten more obsidian and a bunch of fucking stone. Maybe I should use some of the, uh, some of these other stones. Eh, for now, let's just use cobble. That's fine. Then I don't have a diamond pick on me. Okay, I need obsidian, so I need a diamond pick. And it didn't occur to me that I don't have that on me. So let me go back up to my... If you like, I, I can help you figure it out right now. Hello, are you a bastard? I'm not really sure. You know what? I'm not going to touch him. I'm not doing anything. I didn't touch him at all. I did not harm him in the slightest. I'm not going to get the PTA called on me. Let's not use the super, 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 super fancy pickaxe. Let's use something that I can afford to, afford to lose. Yeah, I did notice that you had, like, the bottom of the elevator set up, but that was it. And I was wondering, d did you build the elevator and then it just flew into the sky? Or have you not built it yet? Because I really like to imagine that you just forgot to make the top and it just flew into the heavens because it will do that if you don't build the top okay. one 
eventually, eventually, eventually. Oh, I don't have any water bucket. Oh, no, I do have a water bucket. Oh yeah, that that is an issue I had as well. Um, with uh, and I, I can probably show you an, an example in a moment with the observer blocks. Like there's the front and the back, all the block, all the bits on the side. You can't actually choose the way that they're oriented and the way that they look, and it also doesn't matter. It's this weird visual thing where it looks like it's placed wrong. But it's just like the left bit always points north, no matter where north is relative to it, and stuff like that. So, um, so yeah, like as as long as you can either see the face or see the red dot, and you know that that is pointing in the correct direction. If if either of those are pointing in the correct direction, then it's all pointing in the correct direction. But it looks like it's broken. Yeah, I had that issue. A lot of people in the comments had that issue. Okay, four more. We're getting there, y'all. We're pretty close to having a, well, it's not going to be a railway, but it's still going to be a pretty efficient path. Once it's a railway, that's going to be sick. That's going to be something to show off. Two more. hearing monster sounds and I'm paranoid that like the moment I expose some lava there's going to be a skeleton knocking me in. Okay, we got a lot of cobble. Got obsidian. Is this netherrack? Are you for real? Bud! Bud! What is up with this area and this one skeleton? He's just playing on Undertale rules. Doesn't matter how many times. Excuse? Yeah, you done? That's what you'll turn into. Look at that guard tower looking motherfucker. This is floating bit of soul sand just to hold him so we can shoot people. But then he doesn't see me, so good job, buddy. Hmm. 
are 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 you actual? Right, there should be an entrance. And then this bit. You're a son of a bitch. Anyone else? Hopefully not. First, I'm just going to make a guardrail so it's a little easier to stay on this. And then I will uh, make it taller and make a ceiling afterwards. So I think priority one is going to be making it so there's a tunnel that goes all the way. I probably should have got more torches, but hopefully we'll be fine. Uh, priority one is build the tunnel. And then we can actually go to the mansion and build the other portal. just goes dark. Jeez. And then it goes red. I am making myself a little dizzy. How are y'all? Anybody dizzy in chat? Just because of the, it might just be because I'm like focusing on what I'm doing, but hopefully it's better from a spectator's pers a spectator perspective. I wonder if that's a tongue twister. Spectator perspective. Spectator perspective. Spectator perspective. Spectator perspective. I feel like it's a little hard, but not full on full on tongue twister. Please stop doing that. Wow. Yeah, I guess this is a really long path. All right. I'm just going to focus on making it so there's at least a guardrail. Because apparently that's... I don't have enough cobblestone to actually finish this right now. safety from that lad. Thank you. 
yeah, we'll we'll prioritize this for right now. Just making it so you can't fall. Oh boy, I would appreciate if you didn't, but but whatever, I guess. That's every block. Alright, I'm just gonna go ahead and make the portal. Oh my god. Okay. Are you for real? Do you think you're gonna do it? Okay, so this would be, obviously, why we need a wall. I don't have the materials right now, though, so I'll just have to make it later. I thought that was lava for a little bit. It's just like, how did lava just invade? Yeah, this is a long enough path that we will definitely want a minecart rail, but... We're getting there. Eventually TM, exactly. And here it is, our new guild hall. What in the fuck is that? Is that... A are those llamas? There's some skeletons, but then there's some llamas. Is there like a traitor? Traitor as in with a D. Up on top of the guild hall? That is one thing as well. I need to bring in some lightning rods so that we can place them on the ceiling so that we don't set the building on fire if there's a storm. Yeah, I think that's... I think that is the case. I think there is just a traitor there. But then yeah, some light so that we don't have these skellies. Let's get rid of the flint and steel off my hot bar so that I don't set our entirely wood house on fire.
Oh yes, yes, this is a, a dark forest that is so dank that giant mushrooms will grow. So there's a lot of them in this area. And unlike the nether, it's not horrifying hell mushrooms, it's just mushrooms. He is invisible. The traitor is here and is invisible, but there is his llama. Hello, can I trade with you while invisible? I actually can. That's amazing. Well, have a good day, sir. I wish you luck with your llama. I'm going to see if I can do this guy a favor with that. Okay, that worked. The llama rode the water down. I didn't even have to coerce them. I will see if I can pet the llama, but I do not believe that such is a function. Hello, llamas. Oh, I can ride them. I believe this may anger the villagers, so I will cease. There is also a mountain goat. Hello, sir. Also sheep. I will not steal the llama, but we might get a llama of our own. You having fun up there, skeleton? Not gonna have fun much for much longer, huh? Ah, ah, where are you gonna go now, eh? Ah, fuck boy, I'm not even gonna shoot you. Ah, fuck boy. Huh? Yeah. He had a lot of fun. That was his answer. I also did not bring the building blocks I would need to get up on top of the higher part of the roof, and therefore I cannot light the higher part of the roof. So that's good. Yeah, and the, the dark woods are quite dangerous because the uh, they're set up so that the trees like connect their leaves in so many places that even during the daytime monsters can often still spawn. But so it's a very dangerous place. And as such, the pillagers make a home here. And as such, we come in and kill all the pillagers and light the whole place up so that we can use it ourselves. Because fuck the pillagers. I think this will actually be a pretty nice spot. Now, I should have got a bit more obsidian because you can, you can make it so that the portals are different shapes and sizes. If I brought a little more obsidian... I could make it three wide, and it would look fucking perfect. I don't think I want to go all the way back, so I'm just going to build it too wide, and it's going to look kind of goofy. And then I will come back and fix it later. Out with the flint and steel, use it, put it away. So yeah, eventually I will make that a block wider so it'll look real neat. Alright, let's see where this goes. Not a fun place. 
I can tell you that. I think I might be able to... I think there's ways to, like, change where it shows up to some extent. Negative 120, negative 750. Save the coordinates. So I'm not sure how you go about changing the location. I think if I just break that portal and make a new one nearby, it'll do it. Hold on. I'm probably going to need the, the height as well for this portal so that I can very specifically find it. In the net, because in the nether, that gets weird. Good at video games. Look at that. Look at <laughs> look at that. What do you know? That is very nice to see. No extra work required for this lad. So other than an explosion, I don't know how to turn off a portal in the nether. Can I just boop? No. So I think I will need to have an explosion or get a diamond pick so I can break a bit of this obsidian. Which I guess would be convenient because I, I do need to mine some obsidian to put over there. And just to make sure it's not bugged out or anything, it, it will take me back where I want it to go. Pretty neat. I am hoping that it will let me alter it in the way that I want and it'll still function right. We'll see. All right, so I am going to go back home. I'm going to get, I guess just a bunch more blocks that I can build a tunnel out of and a diamond pick so I can mine up that portal and get rid of it and then move it over. Um, if I want to increase both portal sizes by one wide, I'll need four, and there's more than four in that portal that I'm going to destroy, so I don't need to get any from the overworld. I can just get blocks and a diamond pick. For now, I just want to finish that tunnel totally so that it goes straight there safely, and then we can worry about what's our next objective after that. But we are about done. We are about to have a tunnel that goes from our village portal to a portal that will take you directly into the mansion. It's going to be pretty nice. It might I'm, I'm, it doesn't really bother me, but it might bother some other people that there was an experience drop on the edge of my screen, so I'm just going to go pick that up for anybody that cares. I should also get a couple more buckets of water now that mine are empty. It won't help me in the nether, but it'll help in general. Also food. Go make some bread. That is, that is really nice as well. 
I thought for sure it was going to put me out at some portal that was going to be like a hundred blocks up past a bunch of fucking nether rack with monsters in the way. Yeah, it occurred to me after I said it, like I'm making puns and making bread. Piku really is getting me. I'm gonna pretend we didn't hear that at all. We're just gonna pretend that there were no noises. That's what we're gonna pretend. This is gonna take a lot of blocks. Are you fucking for real? <laughs> Those guys. <laughs> Bro. Bro, just enough. Just, just it. Detection. Can you stop setting my tunnel on fire? to hire an exterminator once I finish this tunnel. Oh. First Minecraft. Stop. 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 I might die. Because I'm out of food now. I'm walking away from my tunnel. I'm just walking away from it. I'm just walking away. I'm just done. I'm just done. I am very much leaving the neighbor alone. I am asking to be left alone myself, and they are not obliging that request. That is the situation the zombie. Is the moon? The moon is rising, so the sun is setting. So we better get going. Not bullying the neighbor. Okay. Cobble deep slate. That'll work, I guess. Well, cobble deep slate is neat. I'd like to save it if I can. I guess diorite. You know what? We can always get more couple deep slate. It is it is pretty common, so I sh I shouldn't be so worried about wasting it. We need that. We need the diamond pick that I left here, and I would like to get some water on the way out. Oh, and food. I have more food in the house. So because we portaled away, this made it so that we were, that the game stopped loading this area. 
and so it the elevator stopped working halfway down. can't go down because I don't have water. I'm just I'm just gonna deal with it later, I guess. Elevator out of order. gonna be real fucking lazy with it because I just don't really feel like it right now. I'm just going to put what components I was able to grab just on the ground. I dropped several blocks of slime. Okay, I guess I gotta go back for it. That shit is expensive. Let me just get some water and then I'll go get the rest of the materials. So we have found an annoying flaw, which is if you leave the area before the elevator can hit the ground, it breaks the elevator. So that's fun. I legit am just, I'm, I, I don't have the patience for this at the moment. I am just going to fix it later. Hold on. I want to expose some glowstone so there's light. Uh, but yeah, I'm just going to fix it later. And until then, the elevator is out of order. It would be nice if you could do a world anchor or something in vanilla. This is also using just a lot of the blocks that I really needed for something else. Okay, let me go make some food. Oh, come on! Mm. 
We having a truce, or are you about to shoot at me? The latter, then. Stop inviting your friends over. They have no manners. They are not our neighbors. And they are a bad influence on you. torches left, but that's fine, I guess. It's kind of incredible seeing just how many stacks of a block you can go through and barely get anywhere. Okay, that particular neighbor, I believe, isn't going to be able to mess with us at this point. Unless, boy, oh boy, do they really try a zombie! Hello! So, zombie, would you like... Oh my god. Would you like to just, um... Just start doing doing your own thing and try it out for yourself, or would you like people to? Oh my God! Would you like people to uh, help you out in the beginning? Because if you want to just do your own thing, that is totally chill. But if you'd like help, that is also fine. Okey doke, I will uh I'm gonna 
try to finish what I'm doing here, but then I will I will head on over. Would you like to discord? Last of my block. All right, let me just get the bit of obsidian and get it set up. <laughs> Whichever you would prefer, either is chill with me. God, this is really just going to take thousands upon thousands of blocks. It's good to have a use, though, because I am, I am making a big tunnel in the overworld, so it makes sense to have plenty of blocks. Or it makes sense like I, I will I will end up having plenty of blocks and this will give me a use for it. like a bit of a goober. Solid color skin and the gold boots. Gold booties. There we go. So hopefully when I change the shape of the nether portal in the overworld, it doesn't, um, it doesn't change the nether, like the location of the portal in the nether, but hopefully we can just make this work, but we'll see. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Do it all right, zombie. <laughs> I don't even know what a husk is. Did, did you like come into the nether? Oh, if you want to chat in Minecraft, by the way, hit T.
Oh. Oh, zombie. <laughs> Don't worry, you'll be a pro in no time. <laughs> I'm sorry, Sophie. It's totally fine. It's totally fine. It is your first time, and it's also not that big of a deal to, mi to die in Minecraft. Uh, hit T, as in text. by Enderman. <laughs> this is what I was saying, zombie. They're bad influence. Yeah, if you see a a tall, a tall, dark-looking lad, do not look directly at him, as his social anxiety will cause him to murder anybody who chooses to do so. Exactly. Exactly. Except more violent. Instead of just please sir do not, instead it's just immediate murder with no warning. This is the same nether portal. Very good. Very good. So last bit is hopefully I can also alter this one and it's not going to have any problems. W would you like to hop in Discord, zombie, so we can chat while you have this experience? Oh, also, I'm seeing your skin. Nice. Hello? Discord overlay doesn't work on Minecraft, so I'm not going to know if you answer or not. Totally fine. Okay, so let's see. Does this work? I guess it doesn't really need to be three wide in the nether, huh? That was an unnecessary risk, but it works. And I can even bop, bop. I even have three obsidians that I can fix the portal that BB ruined. <laughs> so we're good. All right, all right, all right. We now have a tunnel that will take you from the portal in the overworld village. So yeah, from the village to the mansion. I just need thousands of more blocks to make the, the tunnel proper. And I'm probably going to make us the portal in the nether on the village side is also three wide, just so it's all symmetrical. But we are very close to this just being set. For now, I am just going to place what blocks I have in the tunnel. Um, try to make the portals a little more symmetrical. Uh, 
Uh, and then that will be the end of this particular stuff for the time being. Wheeze. Hello! Hi. I see that you are having a very wonderful time in Minecraft. It's daytime, so it's fine now. Do you see what I mean about There's the neighbors? The neighbors, it, it's, it's welcoming party. It's fine. They're just saying hello. Mm-hmm. Crying. <laughs> fuck, fuck hit me! I'm tired of this. <laughs> I don't like this game anymore. When I come back, I can help you get to our village. It's very close to the initial spawn. I'm sitting in the water. <laughs> I'm done with this. <laughs> That's understandable. That's Wait, understandable. You hit me. I got an egg. Uh, hello, hello, zombie pig man. Yes. What even? What hit me? Uh, I was actually, I was actually just about to say. So, have you punched a tree yet? Because until you punch a tree, we can't, we can't what? progress. What hit me? The tree oh, probably. Oh, fall damage. Nothing hit me. It was oh, fall okay. Damage. It's fine. Yeah, everything that can hurt you makes the one sound when you get hurt. Did did that sentence make I, any sense? It would have. But my computer cut you off. Oh, okay. Uh, like when, when you take damage, you make the same sound no matter what made you take the damage. So drowning oh. sounds the same thing as breaking your ankles, etc. That's realistic. Yeah. It is the, just How the general I... sound of pain. How do I? Where'd my? Hello, zombie pig man. I'm just going to push on through you. I don't. How do I place things? No. So if if you would if you would like to break something, you left click, and if you would like to place something, you right click. <gasps> oh, hey, look, the Daily Skeleton. My favorite newspaper, just under the Daily Jet. probably sound like such a big I played Minecraft before but it was always on creative mode so I didn't ever <laughs> and it was on like Xbox so I didn't have to worry about this oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay I have I have returned from another town I will now attempt to Whoa. locate a zombie it's a horse oh horse horse got right in my face, but it was, it was a black horse, so I thought it was an underman again. I was like, not again. Oh. Okay, so I'm going over to the direction that I believe is the initial spawn. Okay. I'm just hitting a tree. As that's you what do. the game wants me to do. Yes. And so then are you repeatedly clicking or are you holding click? I'm holding. Good. Uh, let's see. Let's see if I can find a zombie. Do you like my skin? I, I made it <laughs> yeah. just during the time. Yeah, it looks really nice. Thank you. It's me. It's horse. Oh, I think I see a zombie. Hello. Where are you? I see you. Hello. How do you run? Uh, you double tap W. Oh, I think I think also control works if that's not comfortable. That's funny. I can show I can show stream your skin. Oh. Hey. Hello. Very nice. Ooh, bamboo.
Yeah, there's so much stuff in Minecraft, it's hard to know where to start. But uh, we can start with like basic survival stuff and getting you to the village and all that. So, are you okay. familiar with uh, crafting? Yes. Okay, how, how familiar? I don't remember any recipes, but I know that you do it. Okay. So, when you pop open your inventory, you see the crafting bit there? So uh, that, yes. that means you can craft in your own hand, but you can only craft very simple things because it has to the recipe has to be a two by two square or smaller. So what you're going to okay. do is you're going to want to put one log in any of those spaces, and then on the output area it should show logs, and you're going to click that so it'll make some logs or some planks rather. Got it. Okay. So then now in crafting. Put one plank on each of <clears throat> each of those spaces. If you if you hold all the planks you have and you right click a space, it puts one plank there. And then that should make you should let you make a crafting bench. I got one. Nice. So then you're gonna want to hold. This was that. not here when I played it last, so it's just like it's made it so much easier. Because remember when I when I played it last, it was just like figure it out, fucko. Oh yeah. So then you're gonna want to hold the crafting bench in your hand, and you're gonna want to right click on the ground so that you place it. Uh. All right, and then you right click that. Yeah, and that is how you craft things that have bigger recipes than what you can craft in your hand. Sweet. And then if you like, you can also break the crafting bench so you can pick it up and carry it with you. Dope. I can make a boat. have begun to craft. Okay. Uh, <laughs> nice. Ow! <laughs> you have wounded me. Why would you do such things? Oh, to test oh there my she capabilities. goes. So, is it getting dark again? Yes, it is. I hate it. Would, would you like to get some stone, or would you like to go to the village and hide? Village. <laughs> okay. I believe it is this way. Ah, there is Piku's beacon letting us know that it is that way. Excuse me? Piku is making a house in the sky, and there is a big pole that allows him to reach his house in the sky. Oh, now I see it. Yeah. So I can give you the full house tour later, but we can just get some beds for now. I did not mean to disrupt your stream. No, it's totally fine. I wanted to do this. Uh, so there is some in the mine, actually. So we'll just we'll just go there. Oh, there's a creeper. And speed. So you're gonna want to push this button here with the right click and then walk in. Iron iron doors actually are are a little tricky. Nice. And then, so you're going to want to do what I'm about to do, which may seem insane, but it's fine. 
Oh god, I got switched up. Oh, Beds. Yes. And then that is where the elevator should go, but it does not because I broke it. Because good job, me. Crowd. Sleep. You did it. I sleep. All right, so then these doors operate on pressure plates, so you can just walk into them and they open them open for you. Cool. And we can get you some stone so you can make some good tools. So let's try uh, here. You can, uh, you, if you have a pickaxe, you can just dig the stone. I'm not stealing from anybody, am I? I don't want Kiwi to yell at me. No, this is just the earth, and also this is my mind shaft. So if Kiwi yells at you, you have my permission to tell him that he can fuck himself. That is gravel. Gravel is bad and and stupid, so we, we go yeah, to a it new looked, spot. It, it looked, yeah, it looked different, so I was like, mm, sticky. Yeah. If you do want to mine gravel, that would be with a shovel. But because fuck gravel, we're just going to go mine stone instead. What would you use gravel for? Um, when you dig it, sometimes you will get gravel, and then sometimes you will get flint instead. It's just based on a random chance. And then flint is actually kind of useful. Otherwise, you'd use gravel just like if you like it okay. aesthetically. Oh, redstone. redstone. Yeah. You unfortunately will not be able to mine that with the pickaxe you have, but we can get you a better one. Uh, so you can come back with me. Let me get this. Okay. okay. Oh, two redstone. Yeah. So a similar thing, we're at the buttons. You press that and you go through. Uh, so, first of all, I, I think just to get the achievement out of the way, you can go to your crafting bench and try to that's just such a nice sound coming out of there. You can go onto the crafting bench and try to make a, uh, a furnace. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Furnace. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, okay. And so uh, and then you can use that or any of the furnaces we have set up. It doesn't really make a difference either way. Uh, I don't know if there's any coal. You might need to go get some coal. But um, you can also make new tools with the stone. So you can go ahead and make yourself a set of stone tools because they're a lot better than the wood ones. I don't know how to tell you this. I don't have any stone. Uh, cobblestone. Okay. So what do I do? So you are going to want to go to your uh, crafting bench and make some tools like you did before, but just instead of using planks on the top, you'll use cobblestone. Oh, okay. And then we can actually use the wood tools you have as a fuel source, like we can burn them up to cook, cook some stuff later. Because those are the only wood tools you will ever make in your life. Until you go to a new server or a single player world or whatever. I'm out of sticks. Oh yeah, you can uh, you can make more with your planks. Nice. Then I'm going to be right back while you make that. I am going to fix the elevator. That way, we can get you back out of here safely. Cut. Fuck this elevator up. No, it's fine.
got the ingredients, I'm going to dig my way back down. Uh, let's see. So do you have uh, all the stone tools? Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, well. uh, I was not supposed to jump down here. Oh, my God. I was supposed to dig the blocks down. Hello. <laughs> so that's that's gonna be fun to dig. Um, for now, fuck it. <laughs> for now, fuck it. I'll I'll figure it out later, I guess. Oh, how's your food meter? The uh the the meat things on the right. Uh, oh. Hello. I thought I could eat the egg. <laughs> you could not. Whoops. Do you need some food? No, no, I got the, I got the thing. Eat it. Desktop. Eat the thing. That's, that's, that was raw. <laughs> Does it matter? With, with meat, Is yeah. It? Oh. Here's a, here, here's some bread. Where'd the duck go? Uh, the chicken is in the elevator shaft, where it belongs. <laughs> That's good. Hello, chicken. He's just there now. I hope yeah. no. Like, you guys got a little pet now. Yep. Little bed. Yep. <laughs> okay. Right where he belongs. Yep, right where he belongs. So, would you like to go find some iron now? Yes. That is the next step up from uh, stone tools. So, for the most part, you just dig in a random, like, a random one of these until you find some ores. Um, seeing if we can just find any iron easy. Oh, here's some. Mm -hmm. So it's not always gonna look like this because this is iron in cobble, or uh, not cobble, this is iron in deep slate, whereas sometimes it'll be in uh, regular stone, but it'll still have this pattern of like th these tan lines across it. Mm -hmm. and while you dig that, I'll see if I can find you some coal. Yes. It's a lot of redstone. Redstone is uh, used to make machines, but you need an yeah. iron pick to dig it. So then over here, just an example of like regular iron as well, is a uh, bop, bop, bop. That's what it'll look like when it's in normal stone. And then we got you some coal right here. Oh no, that, that is obsidian, which needs a diamond pick to dig. But the coal's up there. Oh. But then yeah, digging ore will also give you experience, which is causing you to level up. <laughs> There's a little more there. That is lapis, which is, um, it is used to enchant things, but it also needs an iron pick. Mm -hmm. So because all these things need an iron pick, let's go cook some of that iron. Yeah, I figured it needed an iron pick. I just didn't, I knew it wasn't diamond because I knew what diamond looked like, but I didn't know what it was. Mm -hmm. Oh, that'll work. Fuck. 
Okay, buddy. So then uh, this is one of the numbers that's like, it's not important that you remember this, but each piece of coal can cook eight items. So sometimes that can make it convenient to figure out how to do stuff. Mm. Then yeah, once you have that iron cooked up, we can make some tools out of that. Do I have to watch? I don't have to watch it the whole time. That's fine. No. Hey, buddy. Hi, friend. So I'm going to try to fix the elevator again and hope that I don't mess it up this time. Uh, once the iron is cooked, you can go ahead and make yourself a set of iron tools. Uh... Tell me about it, little guy. I have the same conversations with BB's cat. BB has a cat? Yeah. Sweet. cobbled deep slate. Oh, that might be falling out of the mine shaft right now. Oh, if I put you'd... it in the chest. Okay. If you'd like to keep it, you can, but either way is fine. Was this supposed to look? Was this right? Oh, I fucked up all the redstone. That's good. Let's see if there's any in the chest. There is. Good. I forget how to build this. Oh, that's really good. Okay, so where where are we? Where are we? I can't remember how to get to my little. Oh, never mind. A little helmet. Oh, nice. Huzzah. Nice. Got yourself the full set. Yep. Nice. So 
So if you'd like, we can go mine some of the stuff that requires iron. Or we can go up to the overworld and see what's up there. Let's see what's up. up. Okie dokie. Up in the um, overworld. I'm going to need just a minute to look up the tutorial on how to make this elevator. <laughs> so that I can rebuild it. It, it. it shouldn't take very long once I figure out how to rebuild it. I just need to figure out how to rebuild it. I see. Who built the elevator? Uh, I built it. I just uh, used a tutorial from a, a, a YouTuber called B Blocks. Hey, bud, that's not for you. Get off the... Shoot, get off the pad. So, I detect... The... So... So that... Get off the... You down. son of a bitch! Stickies, slimes... And then a sticky on top with an observer on top. Okay, so... We, this is actually probably going to be interesting because I didn't build it on stream, so I get to show people how it's made. Uh, do, 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 oh, yeah. There's that, and do, 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 these, and then some building blocks. So, step one, you make an... So, you get a hole like this, uh, where you have, like, a trail of redstone coming out here to a note block, and a button that can activate it. If I can... Did I destroy the button? I might have destroyed the button. Okay, I'm gonna mine a little bit of stone. Gonna mine a little bit of stone. Just a little, little bit of stone. Then we cook the stone. Do I have any fuel? I don't have any fuel. <laughs> do you have any extra coals on me? Yeah, <laughs> Thank yeah, I do. Uh, I just. Thank you. Then I only needed the one bit so you can have the rest back. Thank you, though. <laughs> so with that, we make a button. And with the button, we boop. Okay. So you're going to want to put an observer down here. Uh, the red bit needs to be facing up. All of the other bits don't matter. L like, 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 how it's sh uh, like how it's turned doesn't matter. It looks like it matters, but it doesn't as long as the red bit is facing up. Uh, which is one that the tut <clears throat> tutorial guy didn't really mention. Uh, then let me make sure I'm placing the pistons right. Okay, so. Yeah. What's up? The duck went inside. Oh. <laughs> well, that's going to be a problem. Get out of there, bud. Let me, let me, let me make a way the duck could protect the chicken could escape. Okay. Okay. You gotta stay out of there, man. Yeah. Um. <laughs> I'll hold the door open. Come here. Okay, that's, that's good. Oh, oh, I'm just gonna go ahead and oh, oh, hold on. Where's duck? Where's chicken? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do this. I'm just gonna do this. I'm just gonna trap both of you. <laughs> no, you can come out, but the chicken, but the chicken cannot. Okay, that probably, that will probably hold it. <laughs> Maybe it won't. Did it jump out? Did it walk under the bed? You yes, it didn't. Okay, chicken. <laughs> chicken, chicken, chicken. <laughs> shoo, shoo, shoo. Nope, nope. Hello. <laughs> this chicken is bugs bunnying us. Yeah, pretty much. Okay. Okay, okay, Stay. that's fine. That'll Baby work. Joe. That'll work. All right, cool. So once you have rounded <laughs> up your chicken and prevented them from climbing into the <laughs> elevator shaft, then you're going to build all of this stuff. So then you're going to need sticky pistons, and you're going to go bop, and you're going to go bop. You're going to need a slam buck to go bop, 
Uh, and then you're gonna do two slam blocks there. Personally, I actually want the elevator itself to be three blocks tall. That is optional, but I want that, so three. Uh, then you are going to want to put a sticky piston. Uh, let's see. I want to make sure... Okay, so, uh, you're going with the sticky piston down here, facing down. <laughs> Bless you. Thank you, I'm sorry. Totally fine. And then you're going to want an observer. <laughs> what is it doing? At the top block, either there if you want it too too high, or there if you want it three high. <laughs> the important thing to note is you want to make sure that the sticky block, the sticky, uh, the slime blocks don't touch any blocks on the way up, other than the parts of the elevator, which is why I have all of that hollowed out. Uh, and then you're gonna, if you are going to want this three tall like I do. Just put a building block in the, in the way there. Then you can put building blocks so that they touch all of the slime blocks and it will pull them all up. Um, I can make it look nice later, but for now I'm just going to use whatever I have on it. And then I forget, I think there's like, you don't want this, the, you don't want blocks to go all the way down. You just want like that. If it goes all the way down, it breaks it. And so only do one if you're only having it be one tall or two tall. But because I'm having it three tall, I can place two. And then you are going to want to go with three on the fronts. And then if you like, you can also put stuff on the top. Uh, buh, 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 buh. I think that is actually it. It is actually pretty simple. The only other thing, like I showed you the note block and the redstone, you're going to want to make sure that directly above the note block down here, you put another note block and then a block of obsidian on top of that. And that is what stops it from coming, stop, stops it from going just all the way up into infinity. And then you're going to want to ho hook up a button that activates the note block. Uh, I have a slightly different system because I have it activated automatically. But yeah, that should be the whole main thing so I can now free our friend free the chicken make sure not to hit the chicken in the process of breaking blocks hello he's on the chests now he is the owner of all of the <laughs> items it is he has decided this and therefore it is so So, if I have recreated this successfully, you're just going to... Oh, I'm not sure if I did. You're just going to want to stand here and then press the... It's kind of hard to see, but press the button that's on the block in front of you. On the bottom. So, so you're going to want to turn around and face me. And then you're going to hit that button. And then I... And then because I didn't build it right, <laughs> nothing will happen. Of course. Um, he didn't did do I it do? right, bud. Okay, so now we find out what I fucked up, which is always a fun part of building this thing. I'm going to assume it is the amount of blocks that I placed on the sides. Uh, tr ow, try, try. <laughs> <laughs> I was the one who, who took damage. Do not worry. Uh, hopefully, try again. There we go. Goodbye. What the fuck? Goodbye. This is a saw trap. I mean, it doesn't hurt you. So. 
It seems like it should. Well... I mean, it would if you fell into the open elevator shaft. So then when it reaches the top, you're going to want to walk off so that it doesn't bring you back down. And the iron door there, you can just walk right through it because the pressure plate will open it for you. And then turn right and you'll see the way you can fall back down to us safely. Oh, that was a really good sound. Hello. Hello. So then hopefully this should come all the way back down automatically because I'm super good at things. Okay. No, 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 no. Oh God. <laughs> come out, out the side, the side, the side, the side, the side, the side, the side. Okay. So then, so then once you finished with that and you made sure your friend doesn't get crushed by an elevator, then you're done. You've made an elevator. Oh my God. <laughs> cool <laughs> yep all right so we have our way out where we want to go out do you want to do you want to mine or do you want to go out uh let's go out okay let's see if we can go out together i'm not sure if that works so let's try it it works hello this is a lot of space hello <laughs> The drawback to this design is that, holy hell, it's so loud. Yeah. No, zombie, no! <laughs> oh, I was looking at my screens and my menus. see your name through the wall very slowly lifting up. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Hello. And so you press the button on the right and you can get it. Okay, doc. That was an experience. <laughs> yeah, it's probably a lot harder than it should have been. <laughs> it, it is it quite a contraption to be messing with if it's your first time playing Minecraft. This is a traveling trader who has llamas. I, I, then also, so you know, if you ever left click any living creature, it will harm them. Please do not harm the llamas or villagers. Uh, I will not. Yeah. Okay. And so if you like, this is Piku's house so far. He is also going to be building an elevator. As you can see, he has a start here. But then, yeah, there are three different uh, types of tree in the area, so he decided to make a house out of all three types. And then he's making a glass it's house in the sky. What's pretty. up? It's pretty. Hey. I'm invading his privacy. Exactly. That's a big drop. Yep. It's actually just occurring to me. I'm going to make a, a, a pool of water for you to fall into so that when you get to the top, you can jump off because that sounds like a really safe idea. Yeah. Let's see. Is that... This? Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> I 
almost fell. <laughs> that would not be great, as there is currently no water. There is only harsh, dry land for you to fall into. so we don't bug Piku, but I'm going to make a little hole here. Where? Uh, okay. Ooh. I keep messing up. Which I know is very comforting to hear. Okay, so I don't know if you can see me, I'm standing next to a small pool of water that you will have to aim for. Okay. Sounds good. So... Ooh. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I see it. I was so close to it. Oh, I have to go back up the elevator. Oh. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> I'm sorry, zombie. You're fine. <laughs> you just saw me fucking splat. <laughs> Your first death to fall damage. The milestones. Okay, we can go back and get your stuff. Yeah. Might be a good idea to sleep, so I think we can use the trio's house. Yeah. Oh my god! Oh my god! It's very good. That looks like my cat, Norval. Oh, nice. We will definitely get you a cat eventually. Yay. Okay, so yeah, that was the house that uh, BB and I started in, and now it's their house, and I'm living in the underground area. Here's our scuffed mm -hmm. uh, enchanting table, where you can uh, you can make your items like our armor tools and weapons better by making them magic mm -hmm. bb was making a storage unit here and decided to cannibalize its walls i see then here's the hole that i put all my stuff in the what yes mm. neat got kiwi stuff or, or actually here is <coughs> bb's new house oh hey 
A flaming neighbor. Oh, there he goes. Goodbye, neighbor. And then, I'll be taking this. Yeah. And then spiders will try to kill you at nighttime, but in daytime, they will only try to kill you if you hurt them first. Hi, buddy. So then this is BB's current house in progress. Oh. Oh, it looks good. They added a new freaking roof during the time that I was streaming. Wow. A new yeah. whole floor. I like how they didn't put in any light so that monsters are going to spawn here like crazy. I like that part. Um. Hmm. That makes me concerned. <laughs> a hole. Yep. A little hole to sit in when you, when you need a hole. And over here, Kiwi Stop. managed to find a bamboo forest and took some of the bamboo back so that he could make a bamboo forest closer by for us. Mm -hmm. And then over there is Kiwi's, I don't know what this is, but it's terrifying. Mm -hmm. What is it? I'm not sure. <laughs> but it is terrifying. The closer you get, the scarier it is. Um. Yeah, it involves a lot of lava and fire. <laughs> so it's very friendly. This isn't concerning. Yeah, and then here is where he made a thing where monsters will spawn and then fall into here. And they take so much fall damage that if you just punch them, they die. And that is a way to get free experience if you ever need more experience. And then all of their stuff falls <coughs> into those chests. That's... That's mean. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty fucked up. That's super cruel. He's so mean to the neighbors. Yeah. I don't know how to activate it. It seems that it just sort of... Just stuffs... Just falls down sometimes. And I don't know if there's any way to control it. <gasps> it's a baby! Yep. You can't hurt a baby. You hurt a baby! I killed a baby. <laughs> Fair enough. There, why is there a chicken? Why is there a baby a zombie riding a chicken? There's a chicken. See? It's a chicken and it has yeah. a baby zombie on it. That's fun. <laughs> So I think that's all the other players. Roy also has been playing, but he went off to make something on his own. So I, I don't, I don't know the coordinates and stuff, so I can't show you it. I don't think there's any Cries. other players. What's that? Cries. Oh yeah. Maybe he will stream it himself. I'm not sure. Here. Bye. Chicken. You killing chickens? Maybe. I need food. No, do you not have the bread? I for yeah, I do. I forgot. <laughs> you gonna eat some of that bread? I don't need it right now. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm just stockpiling. It's a horse. It is. Ow. Ow. 
You can befriend the horses, can't you? Yeah. Uh, let me see if I have some wheat for you to give them. I can't tell if it likes this or not. Like, are you getting on it and off it again? No. Just what are you doing? Touching it. I'm touching it. Oh, like, are you right clicking it? Yeah. Yeah, I believe that will have you attempt to ride it and it'll buck you off, but like eventually you'll wear it down. Like part of me is waiting for it to just kick me. <laughs> I don't believe it will, but I could always be wrong. and I'll be right over. Actually, I'll feed the cows when you're here so you can see how it's done, but so I'm bringing some wheat, which I believe will let you uh, make nice with a horse. I'm not sure. I thought it was carrots. Could be. Might be apples, too. I think I can make hay bales if I have a crafting bench. Let's see, can you can you give it one of these? Your inventory is full. Fuck. Uh, get rid of that. I don't need that. Uh, get rid of that. So if, if you throw it out of the crowd too close to you, you'll pick it back up again. you'll hurt it. So so when you right click it, does anything happen? Like, do you lose any wheat? I lost it. Okay, that means I ate it, so here's a bunch more wheat. You can keep feeding it to see if anything uh, right there. You can keep feeding it to see if something happens when you feed it a bunch. He's a hungry lad. He is. Did anything happen? No. Is he letting you feed anymore? Yeah. He's taking it. Oh, okay. Uh, try right clicking him with an empty hand. See if he lets you ride him. Oh, you did it! Nice. Okay, I will... So we need to go get you some gear. Without a saddle, you won't be able to control him, but we have some extras, so we can get you one of those. Yay. So you're going to want to uh, press shift to get off the horse. But then I'll lose him. <laughs> You'll be right here. I'll, I'll forget where he is. I'll take you back. Oh, boy. Let's not kill this gentleman. Uh, because we can actually cure him. Uh, buh, buh, buh. Over, so you you don't follow me, just him follow me for the moment. Over here, fuck boy.
I'll be back, fuckboy. I don't know if you'll survive, but I'll be back if you are. Alright, so where are you? Uh, where are you, zombie? Oh, there you are. I'm right here. Hello. Hello. So we'll just go sleep for the night. for a second. Okay. Let me get some supplies out of one of my chests. Okay, so you are going to want to be kind of careful with the horse because we uh, we have to find saddles. We can't make them, but I do have a decent amount right now, so I can I can give you one. Okay, thank you. Sure. So here is a saddle and some iron horse armor. Actually, I'll go get you a lead as well. If you'd like, we can make a box for all of your uh, stuff as well, so that you don't have to keep throwing stuff out. I have a chest. Okay. I, I, I could just throw one. I'm going to throw it in one. Go over here. your horse armor and some leads. Yay. With the lead, you can uh, right-click the horse, and then it'll just connect the lead, and it'll follow you around. And then if you right-click a fence post, you'll put the other end on there so that the horse won't go very far from the fence post. Oh, okay. And then when we get over to it, we will put uh, the saddle and armor on it. Should I just right click it? Uh, yeah. Yep, and then with the armor. Uh, maybe that's not how the armor works. Try get like try right clicking the horse with an empty hand so you can ride it. Wait. Right here. So once you're okay. riding it, uh, see if. Like if there, like, see if you can open your inventory, and then maybe there's a slot for the horse armor. Oh, there is. Oh, nice. Horse. Nice. I'm stuck. Okay. Okay. Nice. So yeah, that is the fastest way to go, and I think like if you hold jump, you charge a jump and make him jump big and all. I Hell th yeah. think we have a place I can grab some carrots for you as well. Let me go check. Oh, yep, big carrot farm.
And in case this comes up later with carrots, when you break a fully grown carrot thing, it will um, just give you a bunch of carrots. And if you want to replant it, you just plant one of the actual carrots themselves. Hmm. Cool. I'm gonna. F would you be okay if I went to go find a little place to build a little house? Oh yeah, sure. Mm. Would you like any help, or would you like that to be your own thing? I think I got it. Okay, doke. Have fun a with a video game. Thank you. I'm a yonder. How do you make that supposed? A. Uh, I forgot my it's out of four sticks and two boards, I believe. Two planks. I lost my chest. I need to go get my chest. Where's my chest? dig a bit of obsidian Stay. so that I can improve how the um, the uh, portals look. So the chicken grew up and laid an egg and that Yay. egg did not create another chicken. Oh boy. Where'd my horse go? I just need six, and then I can upgrade all the portals, and then I'll prob- well, if I have extra stone, I'll probably continue to make the tunnel, and then we'll see if I can finish that. I want to stay where I can at least see stuff. Get out of the water, please. Thank you. I'm like over here. Get out of the water. Does it matter where? No matter where what? I put a house. Oh no. Should be good wherever. I should put one here. Horse, please. I'm trying to work. <laughs> being very obnoxious. Don't go anywhere. Hey, 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 hey. Eh, nope. Let's see if it's post. Why is this one skeleton always on this portal? Oh my god.
where my shit is. And then, yeah, just so uh, everybody in chat knows, I, I am getting a bit tired and it's getting towards 10, so I think I'm going to try to make the tunnel or as much as I can based on the materials I have, and then that will be, um, that'll be the end for me today. Horse, get in the box. In the box. I don't suppose you happen to have a bed on you, do you? <laughs> no. So if you would like, we can help you out with that. Um, otherwise, if you want to make one, they are made out of wool and wood. But you don't have to kill a sheep for wool. You can make a set of shears to get the wool safely. Which is just two mm. bits of iron. I saw that. I, indeed, I did. I do that momentarily. I put myself in a place where I can't get to my back. Some bitch. I'll do that in the morning. Unless were you wanting to sleep the night away? Uh, whichever you prefer. If you don't have a preference, I'll probably just do it in the morning. Oh, okay. Because I'm making like a little, a little box for myself. To keep the baddies out. The neighborinos. There are so many yeah. neighborinos right now. I would like not this. like any neighbor neighborly visits right now. Listen, horse, you can chill out, alright? You're fine. There's nothing wrong with you for you to be causing such a commotion. This neighbor is very aggressive. Stop. How do you disconnect a lead? Uh. Oh, never mind. I figured it out. Okay. How do you do it? You just uh, you uh, you right-click it again. Oh, nice. Would you like a carrot? I did not mean to do that. I guess they could only eat wheat. I guess they can't actually eat carrots. Huh. That's weird. I didn't mean to hit you. Take the wheat. Take the wheat and chill the fuck out. I'm sorry. That if it's still not eating, that must just mean that it's not hungry. Which, I believe for horses, they're not hungry unless they're uh, damaged. It took the wheat. Okay. Either I am wrong or it was damaged. I hit it. Oh. That would explain. It was damaged. <laughs> well, I wouldn't hit you if you got the fuck out of my way. Wow. Horse violence. I didn't mean it. Why is this neighbor here now? Why Why did this neighbor wrap around just to get back he in my face? just wants to say hello. Is that a crime? The way he says hello is painful. He shrieks, and then out of his shriek comes a ball of death. 
Wait, bud, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just building my tunnel. I should have. Of course, you stay here. Okay, bud. Stay. Where's my shit? There it is. Nothing get me, please. I just want to get my things. Neighbors, leave me alone, please. Why is it taking so long? It's stone! I didn't want stone! There we go. I'm going to name you Clarice. Nice. Hello, Clarice. I left my chest. God damn it. Don't touch it. I hear, I hear spookies. I hear them big beds. What sort of spookies? I think I hear a zombie. Oh. Brethren? happening. What? What? What I'm assuming happened was because you were on top of the horse, your head was jammed into the block that was above the horse, and therefore you suffocated. Your first horse suffocation. That was not God. how I meant to phrase that. God damn it. <laughs> oh my shit. My horse. Mochi, I don't need you opening my door like you own the goddamn place. <laughs> Do you need any help finding your horse again? Are you good? It's in a I, I mean the horse isn't going anywhere. It's stuck in a stuck in a box. Oh nice. Essentially. The horse is going nowhere. I just have to find where the box is again. Mochi, don't sneeze at me. Ah! Ah! No! Don't touch me. Well, I am out of 
blocks yet again. I'm going to check to see if I have any more at home, but if I don't, I might just... I don't know. Part of, part of me wants to say I'll call it there and I'll just build it off stream, but maybe people would want to see me finish it. I'll see if I have the blocks. But I don't think I do. I think I would have to go digging for them. It's like near Kimmy's house, so if I can find where Bibi's house is. Coming up out of the mine, I can help you out in just a sec. No, oh god, Enderman. Leave me alone. I'm looking. I'm not looking. I pretend I do not see it. It was near Bibi's house across some water. Looks like I do have a good bit more blocks, so I guess I'll keep going for now. Oh, I can make some torches while I'm here. Here's some. So, would you like any help before I go back in the nether? Uh, yes, please. I can't find my... I can't find where the, the box... Oh, okay. Uh, are you near the village at all? Uh, I can see Kimmy's house here. I'm gonna make, like, a little tower and stand up on it so you can see me. So, the, the glass house, right? Yes. Oh, I see you. So I know it's near here, but I don't know where. It's like a mostly dirt box too, so that doesn't help. Let's see. Oh, actually this will be a good opportunity to introduce another mechanic. I'll be right back. I'm gonna get you a spyglass. Ferris, be careful with the horse. Zombie, ten seconds later, I lost the horse. <laughs> uh, that makes sense. So you can right click with that and you can see farther. Hmm. Schmancy. You said it was across some water? 
Yeah, it would have been like across here somewhere. <laughs> It's finding a river over here. I don't know if it's the same river that you were finding. Maybe. That is what you meant by uh, water, right? Like a river? Yeah, something like that. I'm getting some dirt and making myself a little tower nice. so that I can see. And then, um,. If you go into your settings, uh, I think the render distance is how far you can see. Yes. Which is, it's a good idea to keep it somewhat low if your computer can't run too well, but if you want to turn it up a little, like, just to find this. You don't have to, but it can help. Uh, let's see. Get it up to 17 just real quick. I didn't mean to do that. I'm a fool. Okay. Now let's see. Um. There is, like, some wood, like, on the very base of it, if that helps. Oh, okay. And I saw some squids in, like, near it. Found it. You found it? Yeah. Let's see. Uh, yeah, I, I can see you, so if you can look look around and see me, I'll be a bit easier to notice. Oh, can't see you anymore. All right, I'll come over. Where'd you go? Hello? I'm coming. Eh. Oh, there you are. Hello? I'm gonna turn that render down. Yeah. <laughs> really quick. Because my computer's like, what the fuck are you doing? Okay, where are you? Hello. Oh, hello. Where was it? So it is over in this direction. What the fuck? Do you want your spy glass back? Either way. They're cheap to make, so I can always make more. But if you don't want it. Uh, eh, eh, take it. Dang. That's one is right there. Where? A little mound on the other side of this. Ah. Hello, horse. You killed me. Nice. Hello, Clarice. <laughs> Thank you. Sure. Where's all my stuff? Uh, where did you die? In the house. Um, I hope it hasn't been too long. Your items will eventually despawn if they don't get picked up soon enough. 
Son of a bitch. <laughs> so, need any gear? I think that's what happened. <laughs> I hate it here. <laughs> Would you like some tools I certainly or armor? Do. Yes, please. Okie doke. Cries. Some fucking bullshit. <laughs> Truly is. I lost all my leads. I can't even move my horse. Oh, I can get on it. Duh. Never mind. I can move the horse. It's getting nighttime again. I'm going back inside. Get away from me. I'm gonna make a little tower outside with dirt so you can find me. Alright, so I'm in bed. If you want to disconnect for a few seconds, it'll become daytime and then you can reconnect. Hold on, please. Sure, sure. <laughs> okay, you can reconnect whenever. One more thing. Let's horses. Okay, got your gear, I'm coming over. you a copy of the uh, map of the area so that you can Thank find you. yourself. Sure. And this is my gift to you. Thank you. Of course. No problem. Oh, hold on. I forgot to give you your food. Food? There you go. Ah, yes. Thank you. Sure. Kill chicken. As well. <sighs> Who's the culprit between leaving all? Behind leaving all of like the treetops. 
Oh. Just around. That would probably be BB, I think. BB? And you are correct that doing so is generally considered a dick move. It's uggy. Yeah, and how they work is if you if you mine all of the wood blocks, then all of the leaves will just disappear on their own. But if you leave yeah. any wood blocks, then it will do that. It's ugly. Yes. I got a sapling. Alright, so... I think... I think we're gonna move ship because I found a place that I like better. Nice. Yeah, here. Yeah. Come on, Clarice, we're getting the fuck out of here. What's up? It's horse. Don't oh. walk. No. Like the lead's you... not working, or? Oh, I don't have a lead anymore. <laughs> oh, I gotta get you a new one of those then. Uh, no, it just won't. It won't get out of the hole. Get out of the hole. Alright, there we go. There we go. Fuck no. Gast, will you please stop? What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? Don't shoot me. What the fuck are you? Oh my god, he's shooting at me. What the fuck? What the fuck? It looks like a villager, but it's all gray. Oh god, that is a pillager. Are they currently attacking you? Yes! Oh god. I'm becoming. Just one sec, I don't have my proper gear for that, so I'll be just gonna grab my gear and then I'll come in. What did I do with my sword? There it is. It's by Kimmy's house. 
There's an Enderman in Kimmy's house. Yeah. I think the neighbors are really overstepping that. I'm not looking at you! I'm going over. Where is the pillager? Uh, you see that? Like, over there. Oh, okay. See him? Yeah. Hello, sir. I heard you're causing Ow. trouble. Not a fan. Ow. Okay, anybody else? No? That's good. Swap my gear out and go back, finish the tunnel, and then head off. Would you like a bed? Yes, please. Okay. okay. What, what color bed would you like? Purple. Okay. Bubble, please. I need you to not. Ah! It's dark. Okay, I'm gonna come over to your house now. I moved it. Oh, is it near Kimmy's house? Uh, do you remember the little the fir the first little tower mm -hmm. thing that I was at when we were first looking for it? Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm there. Oh, okay, do. I'm inside the tube. Out of my face! I see you. They're being very difficult. And then, so you know, if you like, if you like how the how the logs look, I'm not uh, criticizing that. But if you want a faster way to get blocks, the logs can each turn into four planks. Yeah, I'm just. It was just. I noticed it was getting dark, so I was like, oh, fast. Oh yeah. Oh, then I'll throw out a bit of spare purple dye as well. Ooh. Thank you. Then tell me when you're sleeping, and I'll disconnect for a sec so it'll turn to daytime. Okay. Breathe. The horse would ever get the fuck out of my way. Place the fucking fucking I'm 
sleeping. Okay, just one sec. My stuff doesn't respawn twice, does it? No, it does. It just uh, will despawn Can... after a while, but as long oh, as my... nothing blows it up or anything. Um. When did you say that? Did it get blown up? I don't know what got blown up. Creeper! Some of my stuff. It's off. Nice. Hey. Get away from me. Leave me alone. I just want to live. What did I ever do to you? I don't think anything got blown up. Nice. That's fortunate. <sighs> Fucking creepers. I don't care what Twitter says. Creepers are not good GFs. Does Twitter say that? Yes. There's like a there's a there's like a, a creeper John comic. Oh, wow. Well. <laughs> Steaks were... <clears throat> Steaks were all hello. Good to see you. We are getting towards the end of it, but yeah, we um, I built a whole a whole thing where there's a nether portal in the mansion we found the other day, and we have a path in the nether that goes all the way to that, so that you can safely and quickly get to the mansion, and now I'm just trying to make it so that that path is very safe, like has a tunnel and it's lit up and all that. And this is Zombie. Hello. This is her first time playing Minecraft, and she is doing it on our server, which is nice. I keep dying. <laughs> this game sucks. <laughs> this game's stinky. It is 100% the game's fault and not mine. A giant boar just spawned in my tunnel, so I'm obliged Ow. to agree with that. Alright, Clarice. Just stay there, okay? Just chill out. What is that? Oh, it's the map. <laughs> One of the neat things about the map is that if you ever go so far that you're not on the map anymore, you'll still see, like, 
a bit of your arrow in that direction so you can jet like you can guess where you are like where mm. you need to go to get there that's cool Health back. Uh, whenever your food meter is high, it will come back over time. But if your food oh. meter is low, you gotta eat something. Cool. Sticks. Nice sticks, man. We'll have a good amount of blocks. I think I might be able to finish the tunnel here. Cute. I've been, yeah, stakes for a lot. I, I think you weren't here earlier when I said I'm eventually going to make this a whole railway so you can really quickly get from side to side. But, you know, one thing at a time. First, we got the portals on both sides connected and then the right spots. And now I'm making it so that the path is uh, safe. Because of how late it is tonight, that is going to be the last thing I'm going to do for tonight. But then some other time I'll make the railway so we can quickly get there. And then the plan is to make the mansion into a guild hall.
there's the portal there, so we're almost set. I heard the bad sounds. I'm going back to set. I can only sleep at night. This side here, when you first come into the mansion from the outside, it's up there. I might change the position of the torches, but I think that's really cool. You like walk up the stairs and just right there. And then when you go through the portal, you end up in this tunnel, which will have a railway system later on. And yeah, oh my god. Of course there's a piglin there, just to make it look less secure than it is. Of course my gold boots are gone. Why are my gold boots gone? I guess they were destroyed. So I guess this piglin is going to be mad at me. Classist. Well, I murdered him, so there we go. You murdered the neighbors. Yes. So other than that piglin disrespecting the safety and making it look like it should, <laughs> other than that, it should be a perfectly safe tunnel that you can just ride all the way along. And I'm pretty sure monsters won't spawn on tracks, so if I fill this place with tracks, that will definitely stop piglins from spawning in here in the future. And there's no entrance from the outside, so that should be totally secure. Still inconveniently you have to run, but it's still a totally safe and very quick way, very quick, relatively, very, relatively very quick way of uh, getting from point A to B, because it's eight times faster than the overworld. And once we have the powered rail system, it'll be super speedy. Super speedy. Right. Fast as fuck, boy. Yeah. That will sort of my inventory and stuff later because we've been 
going on for quite a while tonight, but got some good stuff. In fact, I think this might have kind of been it, but yeah, we we figured out a way to have a portal system for both sides. We built the entire tunnel, so we went from no system of how to get to the mansion, like you just had to walk through the wilderness, all the way to a perfect tunnel, and we showed Zombie the ropes. Hell yeah. Good stream. Jeez, now that I'm running there uninterrupted, it's really just sinking in just how far it is. Just like, even when there's no interruptions, it takes a while. Yep, no interruptions, and here we are at the other portal. And that pops us out here in the village. I fucked a muscle. What's up? <laughs> My shovel broke. <laughs> oh. food or torches but other than that I have my usual gear oh and also stakes well. I don't know if you're still here but uh, I did update my skin it's not great because I made an error with it where the you can very clearly see the error with the hair there but yeah, I, I yeah. updated it and I'll fix it later and I updated it so it's no longer the old one it's my fire guy if you want I'll make you a skin Oh, thank you. That would be quite nice. <coughs> oh, I, I only am just now seeing that BB changed the Hello Ferris skin, or Ferris sign to Gift for Ferris, not because I like you sign. <laughs> they gave me two stacks of redstone, a little lapis, and a some bone meat. Nice, Aww. thank you, BB. <laughs> Gift for Fair was not because I like you. That's on brand. Yeah, that's pretty good. Alright, before we leave, I just have to make a response sign. Yeah, we, we we got that project done from start to finish. So I'd say that's a that's a good string. Hell yeah. I'm going to seal myself up here. Up. Okay. Goodbye. Yeah, I am a. Uh, uh, bu 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 bu. I'm getting to that point in the stream where my brain is slowing down a little bit. I'm going to hop out of Discord so I can say goodnight to everybody, but if you're still up later, I'll hang out with you. 
Uh, otherwise, thank you for being here. As there, what should I link for you? Your Twitter? Oh, sure. Okay, doke. Go get it to make sure I have the right. It's very generous of you to link anything, considering I was just like, hey, I'm definitely <laughs> Minecraft. And you're like, let's go. It's like, ah, no? It's fine. So there it is. It is uh, Twitter Zomb Outcast. They do good art. You should buy things from them. Uh, lies. <laughs> All right. So thank you for being here. I'm gonna go say the goodbye to them. So okay, goodbye. Goodbye. To you. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay. Ooh, I'm tired. It was a long Minecraft stream. But yeah, so that is going to be a fun guild hall. Uh, like I said, I haven't really altered the mansion itself too much, but I made it so we had a nice uh, nether portal in there. It's three wide. I really like the placement. I think that's going to look really nice when it's properly done. Uh, we'll, pro we'll probably have like lanterns hanging from the ceiling or something because there's darkness up top. Um, I'll probably haul out the rooms and replace them with various things. I don't really know how we're going to fully make use of it as a guild hall yet, but I think it's going to be really fun, especially considering like the way they made the mansion looks really good. Uh, the only other upgrade that I think I can think of off the top of my head is I need to put a little more light on the ceiling, or on the roof rather, along with some uh, lightning rods so that we don't have any fires start, because that house is entirely flammable, so that would be pretty bad. Good to hear it, Ninja. Thank you. And so I, th I, my, my thought process right now is I think that's enough Minecraft for this week. We got yesterday and today. Um, I, I think what I want to do tomorrow is I want to start on the last Pokemon DLC because that has been something that's like I want to start getting through the backlog, and that is something that is a really important series. I really want to keep going with it. And uh, that DLC has been in the backlog for quite a while. So I think I want to get started with that tomorrow. Good to hear. And yeah, we got to introduce our friend to Minecraft and show him the ropes and get him started. We got to show off our, our redstone stuff in our town so far, and we got to see BB's, um, uh, BB's, wow, my brain really is slowing down, my BB's house so far. We got to check in with two of our friends. And then, yeah, before we, we knew of where the mansion was, but that was it. We had no progress on the nether. And now it's a perfect, lit, safe tunnel that goes all the way. And like I said, I am going to set it up so that there will be a minecart rail that will go both ways. And I'll have like a chest full of uh, mine carts on both sides so that you can easily get there and back. So like you spawn pretty close to our village, go over to the village and go into the nether and then go along the minecart rail and then boom, you're at this place thousands of blocks away that uh, will have all sorts of stuff in it. So I'm looking forward to that. And then there's the, the thing where we have the heart of the sea so we can make underwater stuff and like just as, as we go on, I'm coming up with a lot more stuff that I want to make, and I'm really happy about that, because that, that's just making it really fun to work on it, and there's probably a lot that we can do with this series. Uh, and definitely some good some good fail moments as well. Whew. Like I said, my head is slowing down a bit, though, so I'm going to head off. Uh, yesterday, thank you, Confused, for the follow today. Thank you, Ashton, for the follow. Uh, we have... I'm going to put the links in chat, as I always do. YouTube for VODs and highlights. Discord for the community. And my Twitter. Schedule is 6 to 10 p.m. PST uh, on Fridays and Saturdays every week. And we do different stuff every day. Um... I believe that is it. I will see you guys tomorrow for Pokemon. Thank you guys for being here today. You too, Ninja. Have a good night. Um, 
And yeah, I, I, I'm slowing down enough that I'm, I'm pretty sure I have mentioned everything. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you guys for being here. Goodbye.